guys, what's up? It's the Livy Lou 98 Show. I'm Olivia, and I'm not too crazy about Amiibo or anything like that. Okay, I'm a little Amiibo crazy, but so is the rest of the world. But I only have like six Amiibo. I haven't bought like a hundred Rosalinas or something like that. And I'm not searching for unicorns or anything. Just bought the characters that I like, uh, the characters that function in the games, whatever. But what I've been really looking for is a game that really incorporates Amiibos, that's like really centered around Amiibos. So maybe the answer to that question is the free game given to you on your Wii U, Amiibo Tap Nintendo's Greatest Bits. So let's go try it out. Why are you telling me that's rated E Wii U? I don't need ratings. I'm 17. I bought Mortal Kombat without my mom's permission. <laughs> They've got some, uh, Pretty groovy music. Wait a minute. This is just samples? Great. Okay, it says tap an amiibo to start. So let's start with Mario. Mario unlocks Kirby Superstar? So I guess there's really no rhyme or reason to which amiibo picks which game, because, uh, Mario ain't Kirby. And I don't know how to play Kirby Superstar at all! What am I doing?! How do I- how do I suck things up?! Oh. Like that. Okay, well, um... No, oh, I'm not very good at this game, am I? So, next, let's do Mario's brother. So next, let's do Mario's brother, Luigi. So Luigi unlocks Super Mario World, which makes a bit more sense, but still, something doesn't seem quite right. So I know Super Mario World pretty well. Super Mario World is one of my favorite Mario video games. I won't let you down on this one. All right, let, let's just move on. Now we have Link. Link unlocks The Legend of Zelda, which is also a pretty nice surprise. So Luigi and Link have seemed to have some correspondence in the games they pick. But I already own The Legend of Zelda on the Wii U. Like, this is the literal last thing I want to play. And it's not like you can do that much in The Legend of Zelda with that little amount of time. So I'm just going to kind of wander around and just wait till the timer goes up. Now we have Mega Man. Great! Mega Man unlocks the link to the past. Another game I own and have actually finished. Zelda's your bay. Next we have Kirby. Kirby unlocks Metroid, which I can't think of a game more opposite from Kirby than Metroid, except for Call of Duty. So I actually used to play Metroid a lot a couple years ago when I had an NES that I was borrowing from a neighbor, and uh, I don't remember how to play anything at all. And finally we have the Inkling Boy. Okay, so the Inkling Boy unlocks the original Mario Brothers, and the first level, you know, the one that everybody in humanity has played. Nobody needs a demo of this game. Everyone's played at least the first level. Alright, so that was Amiibo Tap Nintendo's Greatest Bits, or as I like to call it, a big ol' waste of time. Anybody who actually cares about Amiibo to the extent of having enough to unlock all the demos has probably played all of these 8-bit games. It's kind of ridiculous, but I do think it is a step in the right direction. I do think there needs to be some kind of free game center where Amiibo unlock the content around it. And I don't mean Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival because that's horrifying and that's not what should happen at all. But I'm thinking more like Nintendo Land, where a Luigi Amiibo unlocks a Luigi attraction, right? How cool would that be? That's a much better idea than that monstrosity. All right, see you soon for 
really awesome video. Not a Nintendo one, because I'm sure you guys are sick of me talking about Nintendo. It's going to be the Beatles Rock Band. See you later.